getting on for grim death here. It's uh, the weather's turned feral on day. Oh, I, I reckon we're just going to say the next day from here on in. I'm not good with numbers. I can only count up. I'm only partially educated. Uh, so it's uh, rocking around a bit. Uh, so we're heading back from Butterfly Bay back to headquarters HQ. We're going to uh, just uh, see if the boat, how the boats handle this. Very, very torrid conditions. Not cold, but rough and uh, windy. So when we get in, I'm going to try and uh, show you. I'm going to try and show you how we back the boat in uh, with the remote control. Uh, I haven't had any trouble so far, but uh, I've got to be sure if Suzanne Stanley is filming me. I'll uh, likely to stuff it up, but uh, it's quite hard to do because uh, the hardest thing about, I've found, the hardest thing about um, uh, boating is getting the boat back to where you took it from. You're getting any of me in this or you're swaying around like a drunken sailor, like a drunken sailor. No, it is very ordinary conditions and visibility. We've got the radar on. We can see there's a yacht right ahead of us here. I can see him. In fact, he is right ahead of us. I might just ring off at the minute just to see if we can miss him and then we'll come back when I'm trying to back the boat in at, uh, um, where are we? Coral Sea Marina. Coral Sea Marina. Well, it's Sam's lucky morning because when you're parking it, as you know, the hardest thing is to park it, but usually there's another boat right next to us. So we're going to go right in here, uh, but he is going to start off. He's come to the back of the boat. No pressure, no pressure. Never and played video games as a kid, so this is. Uh, he can what am I doing? controls the boat from the remote control from the back. There we go. So he's got no pressure on him. Just don't don't crash. Here he goes. Get it over. Get it over. because the boat wasn't on the other side so it was in the pen all on his own so well done I got the fender well no crashes today yeah it's all on now is it all on no no not yet it's not not yet uh, yes it's on now it's on now yeah. what about the fridge no, it's on. The fridge will be on. This is on. Yep. It's all on now. Right. There you go. Okay, I'll go and tell you just another trap for young players or players at all. Uh, yep, that's uh, that. That's correct now. Would it, so that was it there. If yeah, it happens so again. if you've got any troubles at all, um, you've got your breakers on this side. Yep. And you've got your RCD on this side. So okay. just check both. And why, well, you wouldn't know why they'd have gone off all of a sudden? No, um, just look, there can be... A power spike. It's not a spike so much as a leak. It's a shit. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, look, it can happen for a number of things. It can be instantaneous. It can be when you plug something in. It yep. just doesn't like it. It's, it detects a leakage. It doesn't take much and it will trip. Good on you. So, yeah, Thank you can come back here and flip it. But if that keeps on tripping... Yep. Then we've got to investigate further. It right could right. be on your vessel. It could be on the short side. Thank right. you very much. Okay. Very You're good. Welcome. Thanks. Enjoy the afternoon. Uh, yeah, okay. will now. Thank you very much. Yeah. 
Well, now there we are. Now they are seeing now. Um, I, I I could have gone and checked that it tripped. Uh, I've tripped, checked inside that it tripped. I tripped down going and tripped. I've tripped six times today in the rough weather. I checked the power board in the boat in angst, but uh, they said that the they're illogically built. So there is a power switch on the opposite side to where the uh, power cord comes into the boat. It wasn't said, your fault. Wasn't my fault. And he said no one would know that. And I said, well, why don't you tell people that? He said, yes, yes. Why don't we do that? Well, there we are. So we were in complete, complete agreement as to why they don't tell people that if it trips out, you go to the other side and flick it up. So I think that's problem 29 we've had on the boat, but we're here and we're loving it. And the weather is just closed in beautifully. It's raining. It's persistently raining. But uh, it ain't cold, as you can tell, by the lambswool uh, overcoat I've got on. That's the lambswool overcoat right there. Thank you, that's it.